But Hook had a brush with the uh, with death, and now, <laughs> now something's crazy happened in his dreams. It might be something evil after him. So you got to turn in. Uh, what'd you say? You got to turn in. Gold. Ah, okay. Yeah, I suppose I shouldn't be asking you about that right now. Lo <laughs> loose lips sink ships. Oh, oh, don't think that phrase will give me nightmares for the rest of my life. Just try to picture that old thing that Huck taught you. Just, just, just somebody just sucking on a boat bottom. Oh, man. Fish. Right, right. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Peanut butter flavored boat. Fish lips. Peanut butter flavored boat. Fish lips. <laughs> good Lord. Now, it's a good thing we ain't in the candy business because we go out of it, right? I know. I don't even know what the hell's going on sometimes. <laughs> well, the only thing I mix up is chloroform and opiates, so... Well, uh, opiates, that's some things that get all that get people all relaxed. The, the pain medication. Uh, oh, I see. Too much of them and you uh, get a little squiffy. And what is chloroform exactly? Isn't that shit that plants use? No, that's uh, chlorophyll. Um, oh. Chloroform is uh, it's a liquid... Um, and it's very, very potent. Um, hey, Iron people, King. You, it's most famously known for kidnappings. People put some on a rag, hold it over your mouth so you can only breathe it in. Don't start with me. Oh, I see. I think I know what you're talking about now. I thought that and shit it knocks was. You out, but it, it, wasn't it called. I think somebody already called that ether. Yes, it's like ether, but not quite. All right. But uh, you use it for anesthetic. One to three drops every minute on a cloth over somebody's mouth while you're operating on them, dependent on their weight, obviously. For instance, Cletus would take three drops. I would take one. Oh, oh, there's a little snake there. Mm. So Cletus would but take. It can also be used Cletus in a would lot. take a little bit, huh? Yeah. Well, he's a, he's a stocky guy. Right, uh, right. He's, he's quite sensitive guy. about his weight, if you ever have to mention that to him, be careful. Oh, I wasn't calling him, um, you know. No, no, I, 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 I wouldn't, I wouldn't dream of doing that either. I did, I kind of did the same thing. He mistook it. I, I think he's a little bit insecure when it comes to his size. Oh, well, I would never mention anything to him. Apart from the fact that I think the man is crass and I don't care for him at all, but uh, that's beside the point. He is quite crass. I believe he means well. He just he just takes uh, advertising I don't, I don't and innuendo really mind to it. I don't if he means well. I just... It's... Uh, I don't like to be too sensitive about certain things, but it, it's just... It's all of a much too much for me. I... I yeah, he, he does take it kind of does take it kind of uh, far, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I went to the opening of the fish and bucket, and uh, the atmosphere was nice, and the place was very nicely situated. But uh, being offered a sloppy cooter, uh, I'm afraid it offends my sensibilities. Uh, yeah, that is that is a little bit. Uh, we we had it we had it pretty rough. We had a good laugh, but it is quite overbearing. Um, they had this um this one gal that I brought over there, um, Miss Millie, my friend that lives right next door. I brought her over there and she was quite mortified. Oh, yeah. She gave me a mouthful. Who? Oh goodness. Yeah, yeah, I got a good oh, fussing. I, I mean, I didn't know it was that that raw, you know. And I wouldn't have, if if it wouldn't have yeah. offended her. I, I if I knew it would have offended her, I wouldn't have asked her to go. I was just kind of being civil and like neighborly and saying, "Hey, I'm going to this place. It's a grand opening. We want to come." The the fellas came too, you know, Travis and um and Kaiju. Mm hmm. But yeah, it doesn't means, particularly mortify me. It's just it's more of a an eye roll. I just I I. If I can choose to not be in that company, I'm going to choose not to. Right, right. It's not something that I need. 
Well, you probably get a little bit of that in that masquerade. I mean, maybe. Wait, who's putting on a masquerade? Is it Cletus? Well, I think it's over there. I think it was Delilah, but Delilah works with Cletus, I believe. They both share uh, kind of like custody oh, and no. care of Cricket. Oh. Well, then... Well, then, you know, me going as a denizen of the night and you being my pimp isn't actually too far back. <laughs> I know how that kind of works. Good lord. <laughs> oh, my. They'll try and shove me in that top room and keep me there. Oh, man. You know, I got, I got something to confess. They, uh, they offered oh, me yeah. a little side gig there. And, uh, you see... What? <laughs> well, let me explain now. Hold on. So, uh, okay. uh, the, the Am I fella, uh, well, yeah, <laughs> if you would have saw me that day, you could have been, um, no, it wasn't anything that, 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 that raw. Oh my, this thing is deep, isn't it? When you come up on the corner there. So yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't agree to selling my body. Uh, well, I mean, it depends to who, but, um, no, but they they wanted me to dance. They were looking for I an entertainer. <laughs> so I thought it was harmless, right? Oh, I see. And they said that the money would be good. And they asked me to do a little number. So I did. And they kind of painted me up all, uh, oh my. all uh, I don't know what you'd call it. Um, I guess enticing-like for ladies. Old girl said I had a good body that I'd probably be able to strut well. And it, it, in fact, it was kind of strange because there was a bunch of men there, but I did it anyway. Hell, I, I just, it, I, I was feeling crazy, so I did something crazy, and we had a good laugh about it. But they said I could earn a lot of money doing that. It might be a, uh, it might, you never know. So if you ever go out there and you see old Hulk just to getting busy, uh, it's, it's, it's just on a little, uh, earn a little coin and have a little fun. I see. Interesting. I will not judge you. <laughs> well, well, good. That, that's why I told you because that was just a thrill for me. I kind of like doing shit that just gets gets me riled up, you know. It, except for gunfights, of course. Shock factor, I guess, is what they call it. Is this where we cross here? Well, it's where I'm crossing. All right. Whether it's right, I have no idea. Right. <laughs> it's kind of following my nose. Well, Tavian and uh, Tavian and them had a real good laugh at it. Tavian got some photos if you're interested. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> we only charge a dollar a piece for them. No, I'm playing. That was just a little joke. Listen, as your pimp, I expect at least a forty percent cut. You need a little cut, right? Hey, if it, I'll, I'll I'll take a fifty percent. Uh, well, no, that would be sixty. I'm giving you more money than it's worth. Hell. That's what I said. A forty percent. So you would get sixty, and I would get forty. Okay. Yeah, I like I like that deal. Hey, if you could find me business, for, I'm for real. We could talk. No, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't quite know what I'm getting into here. <laughs> I, I don't know either, but it sounds fun, I'm doesn't it? I'm trying to play with the big boys. And oh, it's not my. Happening. <laughs> Where the hell are we, Gigi? What? Where are you taking us, girl? It's here. It's just up ahead. Oh, I, you know, I didn't recognize this gully. Mm -hmm. What the hell is this? The architectural superiority in this here structure is amazing. Yo, Slowpoke, thanks for gifting that I sub mean, to PJ Bottoms. It's, it's a, it, you know, I have nothing good to say. They keep you out of the rain, I guess. There you go. I mean, you see the way that I built. Build. I don't like a box. No, I don't blame you. I, 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 you know, I used to build real intricately as a carpenter and stuff, but that shit just gets real tiring after a little while. I like something that's practical and a little bit, 
just enough interesting to, to make people eyeball it, but nothing that'll be so extravagant that it's hard to clean, you know? Oh, I understand. I mean, I think mine's fairly practical, but I don't... Oh, know. yeah. I do like your office. A little bit too pink for me. A little bit too feminine for me, but I'd, I'd, I'd stay there. Well, I am a girl. Although your bedroom was quite, quite nice. Oh, well, well thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, that's enough out of that. Uh, the bank's still not open, I don't guess, but... I guess you could uh, do your little business no, in this I here room. The post office. All right. You know, I hustled them the other day about uh, getting a journal, and you wouldn't believe how hard it is to get mm. one of those things. It is? Why is I'm, it hard? Well, they say pretty much only the Pony Express can get them. Oh. Well, I have a spare one if you'd like it. What? Well, I, I, actually, I think they'd. Uh, I, I think they might. I think. I think you could get arrested for them. To tell you the truth, if you aren't Pony Express. Wait, no. There was a lady, and she was giving them out with newspaper articles in them. Really? Yeah, I've started my journal in one. I just you know, tore out the first page and kept it somewhere safe and rest of the journal's mind to write in. Really? I mean, that that might be illegal. Probably not the best place to be shouting it, but Well, I you know, there was what but, I did. <laughs> right. There's some question in what's legal and what's not. I don't think the laws are real clear, but from what Ooh. I heard, because I asked for one quite insistently and and I was trying to come up with something for my organization, right? I was like, I'll call it whatever you want me to call it, lady. I just want one of them their journals. And she was like, nope, unless you Pony Express, you ain't getting one. You know that Flora gal. Hmm. It was Flora that told me that. Well, I ain't telling Let me nobody have a look about at my you. notes about uh, the laws. One second. Yeah, sure. Check it out. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, the only one them used for messages, right? And it's because they cause a lot of lag. They cause a lot of size. Um, to the map, uh, a lot of map size is what I think it is. So they don't want me just taking notes is what it is. No, I'm not shiny. <laughs> What's happening, baby? No, I'm not causing trouble. There's no way for me to, to tell her that in character. So, call, call. <laughs> no way for me to do it. Yeah, Drax had to turn his in too. You can use regular notes according to the law. Oh yeah, I know you could use notes, but the thing about this is, this is this was gonna be something extensive that people could just check, you know. But oh, it's not. Oh goodness me! Yeah, from what I hear, I know this sounds funny. But people that use journals, you gotta they gotta keep track of the, the journal messages, I believe is what it was for the Pony Express. And apparently they take up a lot of space in the file cabinet. So even the folks that have got them early on, mm -hmm. before the laws were really set in stone, I believe they had to give them back. Even I know Tavian gave his back. Well, I have two. Holy shit, GG. Wait, if 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 I didn't know I'm any better, I'm an outlaw. <laughs> you are. Oh, no. Xavier was right. Listen, if you come if you come quietly, I'll just put you in handcuffs and take you and take you to the sale. Mm-hmm. Nice try. <laughs> All right. Right. Will you keep an eye? Well, just put your eyes on that and and watch it disappear for me, just so we're we're all clear that. I've well, no. Did you pay for it? it did you pay for it? No. 
Oh she, right. She uh, she gave it to me. See, it's uh, it says tickled pink. She's she's she was distributing them. She had a bunch of them. But it oh, does say my. in the laws they are for the specific purpose of sending letters via the Pony Express. So this is not something I'm allowed to have. Right. But uh, oh well. Goodbye, you journal. You ain't got anything juicy in nice there. To keep you all ahead, you. Do you? Uh, right. Okay. I remember I have a gun. <laughs> I won't touch I it. Can see. You know, I thought about you just grabbing it and running. I ain't never <laughs> ran in red before, but I'd have tried. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to stand here. For right, just, just stand in the way. <laughs> okay. F Freckle, you just pushed me out the way. Whose side are you on? Freckle, just look at this. It's all that juicy info oh, just going to waste. Her. For a new pair of hands. Calm, thank you so much for the 500 bits. I can't believe. Oh, did you change your name? Did you? Yes, I did. Well, there you go. Holy shit. Good old freckle. Old freckle. I can't believe we, we, we're witnessing the loss of such an important document, Freckle. It just seems like no, such a waste. It does seem like a waste, but also, I'd very much like to stay in Gunsmoke County. I right, like yeah. To be oh, no, <laughs> I hear you. Something I'd quite like to do. I'd hate, I'd hate to see you get kicked out for a book, too. That'd be so unfortunate. Goodbye, Journal. It was nice knowing Bye. you. <laughs> Goodness me. Well, you get your uh, business handled in the bank there? I did, thank you. All right. Lovely round number of four zero. Oh, that's beautiful. Mm-hmm. Have you accumulated quite a bit since you've been here with your profession? Um, no, not at all, because I've been charging peanuts. Oh, yeah, peanuts oh, are going to be... peanut butter. You should be charging yeah. peanut butter, is what you should be charging. Oh, ooh, I do like peanut butter. Hey, have you ever had almond peanut, butter before? Peanut butter. I... Yes. Almond butter with honey is I, delicious, I like isn't it? I do not like bee vomit. Bee vomit? What? what? That's what... We're going the wrong way. Wait, well... Who? Where are we? I have no idea. We're going this way. That's what... That's what... Honey is. The bees gather up the pollen and then they vomit it out and that makes honey. Well, yeah, but that's that's quite a vile way to... Uh, to a vile and descriptive way to carry it now. Hey there, sir. How you doing? Well, hello. Hello. You all look like you're just having a jolly old time. Oh, that's kind of what we do. Doc GG here is so darn fierce. I kind of just got to keep her on a short leash. <gasps> oh, he tells you lies. No, no, no. <laughs> Do you, uh, were you coming from um, the city? Or the town. Do you know if the bank um, was open? No, it ain't the open bank right is now. Not, I'm afraid, but it will be open again in a couple of hours. They said. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. These bankers—they seem to have uh, long breaks. They must have a union. Well, I believe what they do. <laughs> yes, probably. Yeah, they probably do. They probably do. Except they—they they talk bad about their boss all the time. But um, I believe what they do is when they know the train's coming in, they open up uh, specially. Um, but when the train is not passing, they do have uh, a couple times a day that they open. Uh, yeah, I was on, uh, I had my train ticket, but then, um, I got a later one, you know, I, uh, missed, missed the, the early train, so I took another train. And so I, I took the, the night owl train, I guess. It happened. My sister's had her ticket for a week and still hasn't turned up. Um, uh, um, I'm Evangeline, by the way. Dr. Gigi, everybody calls me. Sorry oh. to have been rude. 
Oh yeah, and I'm Hook Willie. Uh, uh, my name is Cade. Pleased to meet you, Cade. Pleased to meet you, Cade. I'm an aspiring Such doctor. The admin? No. But I don't have a practice oh, set up right. yet. There are many doctors, actually. Uh, I come from a hospital um, of Dr. Quill and McCree, but uh, I then moved to White Willow and set up my own clinic. I'm a barber and a, and a, and a doctor. Uh, I can tell you're a barber. You must do your own hair. I, I do. How do you keep the curls in this heat? It's, it's, uh, it's, 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 it's something I can tell you that it's, uh, GG, are you speechless kind of a, over this little compliment that gentleman gave you? Look at you do. You're lush, no. girl. You're just taking all, don't you? She's a mess, I'm telling you, Kate. She is a mess. I was held up at gunpoint today, okay? <laughs> it's, I'm, and then I had wine. Uh -huh. And then you wanted to be my pimp. Right. It's all, it's Whoa. Been, it's been a lot. That took a dark turn. <laughs> yeah, it was a little joke, you see. Now it she's trying to get fault. me in trouble. Cookie, can you mm. dig me a hole to climb in? <laughs> <laughs> There's a masquerade ball, and uh, I was wearing a disguise earlier just because um, of the uh, bandit that was basically harassing us all. Um, and I put something on, and he said that I... I first of all, he said I looked trampy and that he liked it. And then I said that I could wear that disguise um, if there was uh, ever a fancy dress party. <laughs> And then we heard about Same the one, Drax. Ball, and I said, there you go, I can wear that outfit. In and character, said, Hook doesn't know. I go as your pimp? But he murdered me, dude. Gunfight, got killed, everything, that, dude. That. I mean, you know, if there's uh, any kind of business opportunity, uh, I, you know, can't blame someone for trying to step up to the plate to fill fill the, the city's needs, the lands, you know, whatever people are needing. Well... Uh, that's not the kind of needs that I generally fill, no. Haircuts and patch-ups. Check-ups. Right. That, 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 that. don't do much going down. Yeah. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just can't. Just put the foot in your mouth, Gigi. Just finish with it and put the foot in your mouth. <laughs> I've got it. <laughs> By the way, do you happen to know uh, how 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 much is She's the going rate these dude. days for uh, a nice aged horse? Would you say would would five uh, coins be able to get one? Do you think? I ain't ne I ain't never uh, bought a uh, a real um, expensive one. I bought this one for ten. I bought mine for ten. five. How from old the bank. was it when you purchased it? Uh, these have two stomachs, 42. and they store nectar. Oh, wow. It's what's called their honey stomach. It's good horse. It's different Willie's your than their man. food stomach. But they still shit it, huh? Is he around these parts here? Oh, right. Okay. He is... You googled it? Directly... This way. It's bee vomit. I know, huh? Now, Actually, let me maybe, ask you something. Maybe a little um, this way. Before I head over to Willie's, let me... Do you have any kind of business arrangement with him? Are you getting any kind of kickbacks by referring his horses? Um, I generally don't get any kickbacks at all. He's very nice. Gen to me. Wait, wait. If you... Generally, generally. So you do uh, get right. some kickbacks, maybe, maybe sometimes. Well, for myself, yes, but not from not from business deals I send his way. But no, if I was going to say to you, if you let him know that uh, I sent you, he'll probably do you a very nice deal. Oh, okay. He'll give me. I just want to make sure that we're on the up and up. You know, I know sometimes people refer people to their friends get a little money under the table and you know maybe you're not getting a good product you know because you you're getting paid to push order, it I'm just, I'm just asking questions here just asking you know i just want to mm -hmm. make sure you know i gotta look out for myself in these parts i can imagine i can <laughs> well now you done insult her kate there sure. you go you know, I don't want to stumble into to a place trying to buy a horse, and then before I know it, I end up half dead and asleep and naked, and then employed by Mr. Weller's. I'm sorry, what? Well, that turns uh, arranged. <laughs> That's quite specific. Absolutely not. <laughs> 
I'll, uh, if you go directly this way, you'll find Mr. Willie. I, uh, I do hope you have a good day, sir. All right, see you guys. Yeah, take care. Now, you see what you done did? You done made that man crazy no, and start... Good Lord. What a, what a strange fella. You know, you really should be... Not you, I mean the collective you, the royal you. People should be careful who they uh, joke with. Good Lord. I know. I, I was not care for that chap. I was being silly, and then he just uh, kind of unleashed it on us, didn't he? He's a doctor. Hell. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Doctor in training, he said. Good grief. Need a doc in training. I was trying to refer him to somebody who would uh, give him a really very nice horse for a good price. Yeah, and he started talking to about you Gigi being on the take. Him. Oh, gosh. Well, you might want to tell old Willie that uh, you might have referred an unsavory character to his, his business. <laughs> 